I am Adil Kumar. Welcome to my channel. Let me thank all the viewers and subscribers for taking keen interest in my videos and posting their suggestions. Question number one. Given probability of A equals to 0.58 and probability of B equals to 0.32, calculate the following. A. Probability of A when B occurs is 0.2 and A and B are not independent events. In that case, we need to find probability of A and B and probability of A or B, right? So, probability of A and B, now in the case when they are not independent events, should be probability of A when B occurs times probability of B, right? So, probability of A when B occurs is 0 0.2 times probability of B is 0 0.32. So, you multiply them and get 0 0.3 decimal places, right? 0, 6, 4. Now, part B here is we have to find R. Now, there is something common in between them which is the intersection. So this probability has to be equal to probability of A plus probability of B take away probability of A intersection B. Correct? Now we are given probability of A. Let me write here. Probability of A is 0 0.58 plus probability of B is 0 0.32. And we'll take away what we just found, 0 0.064, to get the answer. Correct? Let's use calculator to find these answers. So 0.58 plus 0.32 minus 0 0.064 equals to, in decimals, 0 0.836. So that becomes the answer. Part B. A and B are independent events. In that case, we need to find A intersection B probability and probability of A or B. Now, in this particular case, when they are independent events, then this probability is equal to probability of A times probability of B. Probability of A is 0 0.58 multiplied by 0 0.32 to get your answer. Now, in case of or, since they are independent events, we will do, we'll find this, and this is the same thing, which is equal to, let me write here, probability of A plus probability of B take away probability of A intersection B, correct? So, this A intersection B, we have to figure out before we find the other probability. So, 0.58 times 0.32 equals to, in decimals, 0 0.1856. So we have to take away this from the addition of the other two, right? So we'll add the probability of A and B. So we can write this as equal to probability of A is 0 0.58 plus 0 0.32 minus 0 0.1856. So that is 0 0.58 plus 0 0.32 minus 0 0.1856 equals to, in decimals, 0 0.7144. So that is how we are going to solve the first question. I hope the steps are absolutely clear.